future is here. Starting next year, some Arizona students can use artificial intelligence as their teacher. A new charter school is now open for enrollment, and Steve Nielsen tells us about the controversial idea and why school teachers still aren't going anywhere. That's key, the role of the teacher in an AI world. Are we ready for this? The state approved it, but national education leaders have concerns. Sienna is proud to show off her business. I sell 3D printed earrings. <laughs> So here are two. I'm wearing some crazy ones right now. Sienna's studio is up and running. The Michigan High School student learned a lot about starting a business thanks to an online life skills program. We came up with like a brand and kind of a business identity. We came up with a name and a logo. And that is all coming to Arizona. At a December charter school board meeting, members approved Unbound Academy, an online charter school that teaches with artificial intelligence. Our teachers still do a lot of the teaching role, but they don't do the actual teaching of academic concepts because we know that that's something that AI can do really well. Ivy Shoes says they've tested it on hundreds of students in Texas, and the school day is short because AI is so effective at tailoring teaching to each student. Because everything's personalized to the student, Learning for core academics is just two to two and a half hours a day. AI teaching has been controversial. The nation's largest teachers union saying AI can enhance education, but is concerned at where the tech stands now, adding humans must always be the center of the teaching and learning experience and play a significant role. Will there be teachers involved in this learning? Yes, there will be teachers and we're hiring for Arizona certified teachers as well as equivalently certify teachers around. Class sizes, she says, will be equivalent to public schools. For now, it's only for fourth to eighth grade. Board members asked about student data privacy. How do you keep that safe? What's your your safety component for our mm -hmm. students? We obviously ensure we, we meet all federal mandates in terms of FERPA and privacy. After the two and a half hour school day, kids will be immersed in the life skills program. That's all about what the kids want to learn. And that's where Sienna learned to start her business, impressing her mom. It really gave Sienna and the kids in her group an opportunity to learn things that typically people don't get a chance to try and learn until they're working once they've graduated. Enrollment is capped at 200 students for next year. They're also launching another AI school that'll be for dual language. Steve Nielsen, Fox 10 News.